Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Paul and this is Buster's Boy Camping, or more to the point, this is Buster's Boy Camping, the gear show, which will be focusing on products just like this, the Keshwa foam pillow, which I'll be showing you a little later on in the video. But first, Buster's Boy Camping achieved a small but significant milestone of 500 subscribers recently. And I wanted to discuss to you a little bit of news about the channel moving forward and give you a little bit of an update of what you can expect to see. So without further ado, over to me in a forest nearby. Yes, hello, welcome to a woods. <laughs> Get this, not far from where I live, but I'm a little bit uh, lost <laughs> because I don't come here very often. And the woods for me are a little bit okay, <laughs> but uh, a small significant milestone has surpassed. And I wanted to come somewhere a little bit different rather than the garden. And I wanted to talk to you guys about a small update as well to the channel. So first of all, this channel has passed 500 subscribers, which for me, I'm totally, totally blown away by it. I, I want to thank each and every one of you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you. It means an incredible amount. I'm like really kind of taken aback by it. I'm really kind of shocked because I'm just nobody. I'm nothing. Um, but I love camping and I love making videos. The challenge of making videos from this talking to the camera to editing, it's a challenge and I absolutely love it. But I want to thank everybody for subscribing to the channel. That is just blown me away. So thank you to everyone who's done that. I'd also like to thank everybody who has commented in the, in the section below and on the Facebook page and talked to me via Instagram as well. I'll put the social media links below for you. Um, I love hearing your camping adventures, what you're up to, where you're going camping, what you've got planned, what sort of camping you like, whether it be in a campsite with your family or maybe camping on your own like what I do in a campsite or maybe going wild camping as well. It really is lovely to see other people's perspectives on camping and how they love it and engage with it as well. So please keep commenting below in any of the videos or via the social media, as I've said. And yeah, it'd be lovely to hear what you've got to say. But that said, there is also an update as well that I want to talk to you about this channel. And that is the fact that my uploads have been random, a little bit sporadic over the last couple of years I've been doing it. And that's not fair on you lovely people. So from February, 2022, which this is right now, I want to make a pledge, and that is the first Friday in every month, I'm gonna be releasing a video here on YouTube, on this channel. And that is gonna be either a camping trip, like at a campsite, a camping in my garden, especially when the campsites are busy and everybody's out on holiday, or wild camping. That's gonna be happening in this year. The first Friday of every month, you can expect to see a camping video from Buster's Boy Camping. But then I got thinking about that and I thought, one video a month isn't a lot, is it? And it's not. So on the third Friday of every month, there's going to be the gear show, which this is, when this update is finished, going to be the gear show. And that'll happen every third Friday. And that will feature on one particular product that you may have seen in the background on one of my camping trips. And it's just a video to spread a little bit more light on one item or one product from my camping arsenal of gear that I've got, spread a little bit more light and talk about its many features and benefits. This could be like on this video, a pillow or a stove like the jet ball that you may have seen, or it could be a camping chair, a bed, or even a tent. And you can expect to see that again, like I said, on every third Friday of every month. So more or less, you're gonna get a video every two weeks here on Buster's Boy Camping. So there we go, a short update, a massive thank you to everybody who has taken part Put something in the comment section, liked, commented, subscribed, you name it. Thank you all. I've now got to find my way out of this forest <sighs> and back to the garden. So, yeah, I'll do that bit. And whilst I'm doing that bit, back to the garden. Okay, finally made it to the garden. It took me quite a while to get out of there. I'm not familiar with the woods. And just, it just, they kind of freaked me out a little bit. Just a little thing. Just not my, not my thing, not my bag, you know. Um, I'll probably go in there probably once a year and 
I was like thinking, this, this is the way out. And there was like a really big slope and it was like muddy, really muddy, slippy, slidey. And I thought, whoa, to get down there, I'm going to need assistance or skis or some sort of equipment. Not going in that. And um, yeah, it took me a little while to work my way back. But eventually I'm back and standing by a fence. Why am I by my fence and why am I not standing in the middle of the garden? I can hear you cry. It seems a bit... Well, let me just say, all that mud that's in the woods, there's also the garden. It's kind of a little bit where you walk on it and a week later you can still see your footprints. The lawn needs a little bit of TLC. It needs time to heal. And recently I've been going to the Conkers Camping and Caravan and Club site where I've been doing my camping practices, my wall camping practices. And that's where this video comes in. This is the gear show. And I did a recent video where I was at the Conkers Camping and Caravan and Club site and I used the Vango Banshee 300 Pro. There was huge winds, like 30 to 40 miles an hour, but absolutely loved it because the next morning there was a gorgeous frost. Oh, love it. I'll put a card up here for you if you want to have a look at it. Loved it. But in the background, I did do a little bit of talk about it, but there was a pillow called the Keshwa Foam Pillow. And I love, love this pillow. It is incredible. And I've got it right here. But before I show it to you, I want to say that I'm not paid, not sponsored by anybody. Nobody knows about I'm making this video, not Keshwa, not Decathlon, nobody. I am not paid, not sponsored. It is just you and me. That's all it is. But if anybody wants to uh, sponsor me then, call me and of course i'll be completely honest and say the fact that i have been sponsored or paid to show a product but uh yeah on this particular video nobody's paid or sponsored me to do it i'm doing this because it's a product that i use i love you've probably seen my videos in the past and i just want to share the love i want to I want you to benefit from the products that I find good as well, uh, because none of us want to waste money. M money's hard enough to come by as it is at times. So that's why I'm showing you this product. So yeah, not paid or sponsored to show it. But the pillow in question is this one here. It is the Keshwa foam pillow. It measures 45 centimeters by 35 centimeters and is 13 centimeters deep. I will put that in inches as well for you. Now, this particular pillow I've had in my possession for the last couple of years, and it's so good that I actually bought two of them. So this is when it's opened up, obviously, and then this is it in its pack size. In its pack size, it measures 30 centimetres by about 12 or 13, give or take, because it is squishy. It is like a, a memory foam construction. Now, in the instructions, it does say that this is not machine washable, and by that, they mean the centre part, which is, as I say, a memory foam construction and I'll show you it there it's like a honeycomb so please please do not put that center core section into the washing machine you will damage it and it will be no good and then you'll be crying on your floor because you haven't got a pillow to cry on <sighs> yeah however if this does get any dirt on it you can use a damp cloth damp not wet damp and wipe any dirt off that's fine in that respect. This, however, the cover, you can throw that into the washing machine. I usually put these on a daily wash, like an hour wash, like a 40 degree wash. Works a treat, brilliant, absolutely love it. Um, as I say, I've got two, and the reason why I got two is because I loved it so much and it was incredibly comfortable. But the trouble is there, is, there is only one drawback to this, and I think you can see it from here and that's the pack size. 30 centimetres by about 12 or 13 centimetres is quite big if you're going to be going wild camping. Um, if you can fit it in, into your pack, great. Right? If not, then maybe something like this is going to be better for you. This is the Trekology Aloft 2.0 pillow, and I've used that. That's featured on the channel too. Uh, and you can see the pack size there is just... Well, look, there you go. That is the Trekology of 2.0. So if you're going to be going wild camping or space in your pack or your car is at a premium, maybe something like that may be more suitable. But if it's comfort you're after, the Keshwa foam pillow at £17.99 at the moment from Decathlon, I think is amazing, Bo. As I say, it's my opinion, just my opinion. Your opinion may differ, but my opinion is the fact that this pillow is exceptional value for money. Incredible night's sleep, incredible pillow. Go get it if you're after a pillow. There you go. That's the first gear show done. 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more and want to be notified of future video releases, please consider subscribing to the channel and clicking on the bell icon to be notified of such videos when they come out. There will be a video on the first Friday of March when I go camping again, and then two weeks after that, there'll be another gear show as well. So keep an eye out for that. Right, I'm going to go in because it's getting cold, so I hope to see you again on the next one. Thank you very much for watching, and take care for now. Bye-bye. He's taking a peek. Buster's taking a wee. <laughs> Buster, come here. Hello that I've got right here, and I'll be discussing, uh, discussing, discussing. What is the word? Discussing, discussing. I don't know. What answers on the postcard? My dog Buster. Hello, mate. You just had your dinner. I can smell your dinner. Hey. You good boy. You good boy. Yeah, say hello. Say hello. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Yeah. You're gonna go in. Go inside. I'll see you in a minute. Come on, inside. Good boy. Bless his heart. Hello, which I'll be showing you a little later on. How are you? Uh, I'm not Hawaii again. <laughs> Hawaii. <laughs> I could just feel it coming in. It was on the tip of my tongue. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> oh, no, not again. <laughs> oh.